us? I said, there's a yes. You know what? This is a nice phone. You should have given me the first time I asked you. <laughs> I'm going to have to take this. Teach you to be more polite to strangers at me. I'll get you, man. What? Dick is refua. Marco som hoidam. To the said I limu. I took English, you waste, man. Hey, Kieran, let's bounce, man. It's banged up. I'm feeling hungry. You're lucky. Everybody know why we're here? Yeah, yeah. Already know. Quickly get this done, the bell. <laughs> Man, this is taking ages. I got college in the morning. What? Are you serious? Man, allow college. You don't learn nothing there, man. Man, I stopped going college time ago. Waste my time. You don't learn nothing there. Like Might as well be on the street earning money, man. That's what I do. Bob, you get EMA. That's like what? £30 a week. Because that's peanuts. Wait. If £30 so much to you, why are you here? Because I'm only with the man there, minute. Alright, wait, wait. You just wanna roll with us. You don't care about the money. Mata gave us your share in it. No, 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 it's bliss. <laughs> Jess? Hi Carly. Hi, how you been? Kinda of rubbish, to be honest. How are you? Yeah, I've been fine. How's everything? It's quite cold out here. Yeah, I know. Listen, uh, I really haven't got the time for this. I've really gotta go, alright? You sure you're alright? Yeah, I just had a rubbish day. I've just worked a night shift. Okay. Take care, okay? Uh, and you. Hey, where's Femi? I haven't seen my man all day. But his wife is also going to shift him. <laughs> that was in the morning. His wife's Lengo. If that was my girl, do you think you'll see me? What <laughs> you say? <laughs> Find one. D, go with him. I'm dead. Now. You're probably wondering why I'm doing this. How did I become like this? Was I always this person? Ever heard of desperation induced by circumstance? You shouldn't have. 
because I invented that phrase to rationalise what me, my boys, and probably what most men on the road do to survive. You probably know what it means anyway. Growing up, I was a wuss. I was never one of the top boys, as it were. I mean, one of the ones that people either feared or respected. The ones the girls seemed to like, but just treated most of them as if they were anything. Kieran? Yeah? There's a question I've been dying to ask you for a long time. But I'm scared of the answer. Yes? Huh? You were going to ask me a question? Oh, yeah, anyways, there's this boy. He's so cute. I was the one that people would only talk to because I was intelligent. Hello? Kira! Idiot. The one that everybody else would get to do their homework, ask for advice, and all the other BS. Nobody took me seriously though. At least most of the girls. Are you saying? Oh, no, no, no. And it's enough for me to go around, you know, okay? Oh. Yeah? Oh. Yo, Kieran! Kieran, come here! At first, I thought I was popular and well liked, but I suddenly realised that I was being used. Hi, Roxy. Cool. So, Kim, where's my homework done? I'm not doing your homework. What? I'm not doing your homework. I'm tired of being walked over. You think you're a bad man now? I didn't say that. What, Kim? You try to impress Roxanne? Why are you trying to impress something that's not yours? Daniel, man, allow him. Ma, not even. Don't let him talk to you like that, dear. And once I found that out, that's where it began. I'm not scared of you no more. No one is. Oh, my days. Deal with him. Stop stirring, man. He's all right. Meet Daniel. You know in life there's going to be people who look at you once and they just don't like you for whatever stupid reason. This is one of them. And he hated me even more when I refused to do his homework. Don't forget who you're talking to. Dan, you're allowing, man. Oh, what? You gotta stop being my girlfriend. Shut up. Hey, Daniel. Well, Marcus, man, something to do with you. What are you doing? Put the bread in. Stay out of this, man. What? You don't speak to stay me like that. Stay out You know better. Hey, stand up. Listen, next time you mess with this bread, you know, I'll come find you. See what I mean? You might get shanked this time. I'm lucky that I came this time. You are saying you won't get hurt. No way, man. And that, man. I hurry up. And that. Give me that as well. I'd love to tell you more about my life and the reason why I am what I am today. Cause I have to. You have to. You say it's if it's your job or something, man. <laughs> no, cause. So what you saying? A lot, you know, a lot. I'm sorting my life out. So, how's that going? I'm on the street dancing. Street dancing? Yeah, I can see you, know. Cow on me. Street dancing. <laughs> yeah, man. I've been like trying to set up my own dance company and been trying to find the premises so I can make my own dance studio. Premises? So you stepped up in the wall of the words as well. <laughs> hey, you know Maria? Yeah, 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 that nice girl you're going for. Yeah, she's carrying my baby. What? Yeah, yeah you man. Serious, guys. And I can't be messing about this year. You're serious. In about eight months' time, we're gonna have two mouths to feed. At least you got something. <laughs>